Hi guys! Back to unboxing. Um, this just arrived today. Um, note that it's a different box this month. Um, I decided to uh, stop the previous subscription box. I'd had it for a year at that point. At that point. Um, and it just wasn't satisfying me enough. Hey, welcome to the stream. We're doing we're we doing a little unboxing first. I've started doing this with my little boxes I get every month, and then we'll be playing some modded Minecraft afterwards. <laughs> yeah, so lately I've been getting stationary boxes, and I was getting one called the Inku Crate before. It just wasn't satisfying me enough, and then I heard Zen Pop is pretty good, so I'm trying them out, seeing how good they are. <laughs> It's just, mm, this one is taped really well, by the way. Like, oh my god. <laughs> no, I still have to break the tape over here, too. Ah. There we go. Ta-da! <laughs> Let me just bend this back so it'll stay up. Oh, this is so cute. Look at this. <laughs> I have been great. Um, been doing quite a bit more streaming lately, which is nice. Um, and and just in general, doing great. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. I got these cute little masking tapes. Let's see if I can get the camera to like it. Let's open it. You had seen a couple of the streams on YouTube because Twitch issues. Yeah, fair. I'm I'm glad that uh, me uploading things on YouTube has been useful. <laughs> I don't get a lot of views on there and stuff, but that's okay. It'll get there. <clears throat> and then the mine colonies I've recently started uh, trying to edit to uh, try out editing skills because why not <laughs> so we get these cute little masking tape and this one Ooh. and this one those are really cute <clears throat> and they look like they have a lot of um tape in there like all in those holes is where it's all filled in and they also click together and that's that's really cool as i mean it has just recently been upped like did you get a couple extra subs today uh i haven't checked today no new subs recently but I have been getting just a few extra views. Like, the Mine Colonies video did very well. I'm very pleased with that. <laughs> There's been, like, 16 views on it. And only an average view duration of, like, five minutes. But, like, it's something. <laughs> sometimes I get, like, very good push videos. And then sometimes not so much. Okay, and this here is the little little canisters or dispensers or whatever you want to call them <laughs> damn right Dan good about the views yeah pretty much uh as far as I know all the views on my YouTube channel right now are uh people I know which is hilarious <laughs> you could ah it goes that way I figured it out they have a certain way to go in <laughs> it's so cute yeah, I I keep um <clears throat> I keep information in my journal about uh how my YouTube is going and how my Twitch is going and stuff. So I can keep an eye on which videos do well. Ah, <laughs> oh, these are great. Uh it goes that way. I I love it. I'm I'm definitely gonna find a reason to use them. And the dispensers also click together. 
Like, <laughs> that's freaking cool. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> they just, they just, they're pretty solid. I love that. Okay. So far, A plus on the box. Aw, <laughs> oh, look at that. It's nail clippers. But like, a cute little, little Japanese doll. It's like so cute. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. oh, that's really nice. <laughs> I really like that. I already have a set of nail clippers, but like this is really cute. <laughs> And like I assume you you can use them for other things other than nail clipping, but like, oh my god, <clears throat> that's adorable. What's this thing? It's a decoration crayon. <sighs> Come out! It it slides. Does it slide back down? Yes. I just have to use some effort. Slide it back up again. Come on. Yeah. Let's see if I can find some paper. I usually have a pad around here somewhere. Ah, it's over here. To nail clippers. You have two hands, two feet. You obviously need one for each. Exactly, yep. <laughs> just move that out of the way for a second. We'll just grab this and raw. Look how cool that is. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I broke it! I pressed too hard. No! It's okay, I can still use it. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. I was just a bit too rough with it. It's fine. It's just the way that it's built. The way that it's all crammed together. <laughs> it's okay, because there's still more in here and I can hold this one and use it. It's It's fine. Everything's fine. I'll just put it put it back in there as if nothing happened. It's okay. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> but like it looks cool. <laughs> I don't usually use crayons very much, but I could. I could use crayons. It's a thing that I could do. Put that off to the side in my rubbish pile. What is this? Uh Flat long eraser, apparently. Don't know if you can read that very well. Oh. <laughs> Comes in a little sleeve. And it's a it's a really fat long eraser. <laughs> Look at it. That's great. <clears throat> Where's, where's one of my pencils? Whoop! Let's grab this one. <clears throat> this is the one I've been using recently. Let's put some stuff down. Let's see how well it erases. I mean, it's not the best, but it's pretty okay. So, yeah. And it's it's pretty aesthetic. <laughs> that that's pretty cool. <clears throat> next thing, next thing. Mm. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, we got this, which is like little pads. I think. Oh, this one comes down. That one goes off to the side. It's little little pads to write on. Little sticky notes. Those are really cute. I like the top one. It's so pretty. Next thing. Stickers. Oh, these are some cute stickers. <clears throat> They're like autumn themed. Unfortunately, it's not autumn here. Maybe I'll save them for later on. <laughs> 10 twitch and ruining all my little faces. Aw. <laughs> It's... <clears throat> oh, it just opens at the top. Ah, the stickers are being left behind. Come back. 
Yeah, those are really cute. I will definitely find an excuse to use them when it's autumn. <laughs> I love stickers. There's so many stickers. <clears throat> yeah, next thing. These are cute. And we've got envelopes, I think. I think these are envelopes. Yeah, the envelopes. And then we've got these. They're like cards, I think. So they're like little postcard type things. Look how cute these are. And that one. I don't write letters to people at all. So like... I have a bunch of letter writing stuff that's like piling up now since I've been getting stationary boxes. But that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> They're really cute. I like them. You got the all the illustrations showed on the back. Put those down there. Aww. We've got another letter set. <laughs> Oh, that one's sticky. Let's get everything out of here. Oh. Write letters to the company. Explain you don't write letters. <laughs> oh, these are the these are the envelopes. Oh, and this one's like a display. So, like, here's the here's the letter inside of the envelope, so that it looks like a little little landscape. <laughs> That's so cute. So there's the envelopes on their own. They've also got like this uh really nice uh strip along here so that you can uh pull it back and stick it. Yeah. Here are all the the letters. Oh, those are really nice. And then this one's folded down. Uh, that's really cool. And last but not least, there's a pen hiding in here. A zebra click art pen. I do like zebra pens. Zebra pens are pretty good. <laughs> Get one of these, so cool. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, zebra pens are pretty cool, I believe. Yeah, these are zebra pens that I use for my journaling. The Sarasa clip. Hey kid, hey, sorry, I was reading your comment. Hey Connie, <laughs> welcome. <laughs> Just doing your lurking. Fantastic. We'll be starting Vine Colony soon. Get a little click art pen. Oh, it's like a marker. This is a marker. Whoa. Uh, where did I put that pad? <clears throat> Ooh. That writes really well. I like that. It's like this nice, soft, sagey green. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna like that. Yeah, zebra pins, I'm a big fan of. And they're great. Oh, that's cool. I'm a little sad that, like, unlike other subscription boxes I've gotten in the past, they don't have like a little booklet with like everything in it so you can look through it all. Um, <clears throat> instead they have like a, there's this little QR code which you can scan um, to to get all the information on the items and stuff. So what I might do is I'm going to, I know where to go to get that information. Anyway, maybe, maybe not. Uh, let's just type in the link because I'm not doing it on my phone. We're doing it on the computer. So bit.ly slash zp footer one one. Let's go get information on the items. No, that did not take us to where we wanted to go. Okay, let's grab our phone. 
<laughs> this will just be easier. There's zipper pens. <laughs> Why so many different types of pens? No zebra pens. <laughs> like the animal. Um, they're they're a Japanese brand and they're very very good. Okay, we have scanned the QR code. There we go. Okay. I have the information on my phone now. Okay. So let's let's go into the detail of the items because like that's a fun thing to do. <clears throat> so these here are Tamura Miki No, go away. Uh Chigiri Chigire card from Kamiso Shensho. Miki Tamura is a talented Kansai-based artist, which is where she we are also located too. She is active in a wide range of activities, such as soul exhibi exhibitions, workshops, and visual production. For your Zen Pop stationery box, we got you a unique card that is perfect for you to use masking tape on and write some unique and create some unique art. Each pack contains five cards and envelopes with simple line designs that are made in Japan. Cut out, and cut out some of your masking tapes to add color and texture to the flower and the trees and more. <laughs> That's okay. Why can't we go back to feather pens? Good pens. I mean, a lot of a lot of journalists do use uh, feather pens and like ink pens and stuff, like proper fountain pens, which are really cool. I don't trust myself with them. <laughs> okay. And then these pretty, pretty envelopes, this letter set, uh, Landscape Letter Set Sunset from El Commune, Com Comun. Another beautiful letter set that reveals unique landscapes in the inside of the letter paper and envelope with their faded textures, you get a nostalgic feeling to simpler times. Both the paper and the envelope come in premium quality and are a pleasure to the touch. They're perfect to send to someone you care deeply about and make them feel that they are special to you. Ah, very nice. Put those off to the side with the other one. What was next? We've got th this one next. Awaku Sukiru Fusen Dried Flowers. I, I'm really sorry, by the way, uh, anyone who's watching this now or in the future if I'm butchering any Japanese. <laughs> I do my best. My brain doesn't always work. <clears throat> to ho Okay, to Maru from Kamadia. Simple and elegant sticky notes with pleasant dried flower patterns. We all need some peace and quiet from time to time, and that means toning down our environment too. Summer is over, but we can preserve its beautiful flowers throughout winter on these soft and relaxing notes. Spread them around your desk, your notebooks, and walls until spring comes around. That's so cute. The envelope isn't to be sent back to the company. No, no. You send them to your loved ones, your friends. I might just stockpile a bunch and eventually if like I feel like it and I have enough like fans I can send I can have like Patreon tier to send them letters or something. I don't know. I wouldn't even know what to write though. <laughs> be like, yeah, have some pretty pretty stuff. Uh <clears throat> Next is, uh, stickers. <laughs> so the stickers are Tamura Miki Autumn Masking Seal from Kamiso Shancho. Make your environment reflect how you feel. Those autumn stickers are perfect to set the mood. Those are another piece of art from our local artist, Miki Tamura. The stickers fit perfectly on a smartphone, your PC, or some of your notebooks. They can easily be removed and replaced somewhere else whenever you feel like moving them around. Okay. So they must be pretty good stickery stickers, if they can just uh, be moved around. Because a lot of stickers, you put them down, and they're gone. <laughs> and why can't the company be my loved ones, huh? The company needs some love too. <laughs> I mean, they can be. So, uh, the masking tapes. Bobbin tape from Ko Kokuyo. Made to look like the bobbin you'd like you use to knit your winter beanie. These cute masking tapes fit perfectly with the cozy autumn mood you're currently setting up in your home. Unfortunately, not my home, unless you count the, the Halloween mood that I'm putting around. 
Like, I've got this little guy hanging out with me. <laughs> he's cute. Um, I got him a few years ago. He's, he's, he, he helps really set the mood. They can be clipped together for easier storage and make sure that you don't lose them. And then Petite Cutter from the same company. He's a cute cutter to go with your masking tape, soft colors, easy grip, and more importantly, a clean cut from Kokuyo. Add your roll to the conveniently shaped cutter and never worry about how to cut your masking tape. This cutter was especially designed to match the bobbin tape that you also have in your box. Which is very nice. Next thing is the, the crayon, which I broke a little bit, it's okay. Um, the decoration crayon from Midori. Ready to add some colour to your life, Midori is famous for the quality of their crayons and those colours are matching the season. With all the leaves turning from green to red, orange and yellow, we thought why not give you the tools to draw the scenery outside your window. That's nice. Uh, and then the Click Art Pale Colour from Zebra. When it comes to pens, Zebra makes some of the best. How can you not be... <clears throat> How can you not be when you've been doing pens since 1897? <laughs> Wait, isn't masking tape like easily ripped? Like no need to cut? Some. Some. Um, this feels like a little bit more plasticky. Um, so it would probably be easier to cut it than try and rip it. But yeah, <laughs> usually. Anyway, uh, those pale colors have a soft touch on the paper and a clean line. The grip on the click art pen is smooth and comfortable, perfect for longer design sessions. And then finally, uh, well not finally, we've got one more thing after this. Um, <clears throat> the flat long eraser from Sunstar Bungu. Do bulky erasers also bug you when you have to place them in your flat pen case? Same here. That's why we got you some original flat and long erasers that will fit perfectly into, into any pen case. Sunstar is actually one of the first Japanese stationery companies that started thinking about our environment and developed an ecology series back in 1990. That's really cool. That's that's fun. I mean, this is the usual eraser that I use. Like, this is so good. It erases so well. I love it. And then finally, the bonus gift, the, nail, the Kokichi nail clipper. Have you ever seen Kokichi dolls before? Yes, they're adorable. Kokichi dolls represent the wish for a healthy child and others that, that they bring children closer to the mountain spirits. They have been around for over 100 years. Did you know that Nintendo also used them as inspiration to create their digital avatar Miis? Now here we have a simple yet elegant nail clipper as, for you designed as a Kokichi doll. That's great. <laughs> and that is all the information we have on the items in the crate. That's really cool. They also have like a little code here. <laughs> we hope you enjoy your pack. Save 700 yen off on your next pack with, with Japan lover code. So, you know, if people want to use that. <laughs> And that's so cute. I love it. I love their little mascot. It's very cute. Okay, let's gather all those things to the side. We'll just put them all together over here. They're all very cute. And later I will be organizing these into a cute little spread for my Instagram. So that I can share that on there. Oh, which way around did this go? There. Sit. There we go. Hey, Tiff. Welcome. Look, we have a long lost follower in the chat. <laughs> He's back. Um, yeah, so that's, that's that. Um, just for the YouTube video, uh, anyone watching on YouTube, you know, uh, let me know what you liked out of this. Uh, all right. I usually I usually do the whole um, what was my favorite things. Uh, favorite things would definitely be the pen, the stickers, maybe these little notes. 
and then the masking tape after that but like that that order like they're really cool those are my top three uh anyone on uh youtube comment what your favorite thing was what your least favorite thing was um stuff like that and make sure you look after yourselves because you're important and i'll see you next time for the next unboxing if you're just watching my unboxings or for the next gaming video if you watch my gaming videos um bye